So I'm not sure if loss is trolling or whatever, but dating man, dating men is not a job interview. I'm not going to sit here with my resume and list of qualifications as to why I should be picked. Like, you're not a king, sir. Sit down. Men, literally all men feel like they should be treated like billionaires. Like they have a kingdom, like they're Jeff Bezos. You're average. You have an average job. I'm not proving myself to you. I, like, what makes me stand out? Well, you need to tell me what made me stand out because you're the one that approached me. Like, are you a trillionaire? Why do I need to tell you what makes me stand out? Are you Prince Williams? Like, are men okay? Like, I don't know. Like, I'm like... I know I may sound animated right now, but like, I literally cannot believe that this man, what makes you stand out from all the other females? What the hell? What kind of, I don't know if I can say this on TikTok, but what females are lusting after you? Where's your $30 million house? So for you guys that can't see what that says, it says he's basically asking what makes you stand out from all the other women he can talk to. This logic is very self-centered. Now, I personally don't even see that as an attack. I see that as a valid question. But look how triggered she is just from this question. And she has a lot of videos just like this where men are, men are asking her a simple question and she just explodes. See, she is over perpetuating her, her beauty. Um, the truth is, you're not even average at best. I'm just going to keep it a buck. You got 50 pounds of makeup on your face. You definitely bitter. You're trying to make yourself look younger. I can see it exposed in your neck. So you're in competition with the younger women. You're mad that these younger women are getting these men that you want. So you want to try to pretend like you in that league, but you're not. Yes, you need to qualify yourself. All women need to qualify themselves to a man if they want commitment. Because men are the ones that provide commitment. Men are the ones that provide the security and all of that. So why wouldn't a woman have to qualify for getting that? Oh, I know why. Because women think they're entitled to everything a man has. Okay? That's what the bottom line is. And like I said, you're less than average at best. Seriously. So the attitude is not something that a man wants to deal with. Why deal with you and all of that noise? And all of that ac accusations, just like, you know, the question, imagine being in a relationship with this person right here and you ask a basic question, not attacking, but a basic question and you get this kind of response. The reason why she doesn't want to answer this question is because she knows that she doesn't have anything that makes her stand out. She knows that she's not even average at best. She knows that. That's why she doesn't want to answer that question. And unfortunately, guys, this doesn't just apply to women that we may see as below average. It applies to a great majority of them. They all, or not all, many of them have this same type of thought process. And I think the ones that are lower on the scale tend to have way more attitude. They have to pump their chest out and prove that they're worthy. There's a lot of different ways you can prove your worth to a man if you want a committed relationship. This is not it. Because see, it's not always about looks. Well, it is initially for us. But it's the character of the person. There's a lot of beautiful women out there that are rotten to the core. There's a lot of women out there that are average, that are not rotten to the core. There's some women that are below average that are better than every other woman that's higher up than them in that number scale. So it's your character. You're, if you're leading with this type of attitude, you're leading with 50 pounds of makeup on your face. You're leading with trying to uh, trick men to make them think that you're younger than you are. And another reason you're doing that is because you want to uh, prove that you're you look better than some of these women because you guys are in competition with that that whole thing but you got 50 pounds of makeup on your face you got a loud mouth you sound very bitter you sound like you know you're just mad you ju you're just mean so you have a lot of red flags and i don't even know your age but you have a, that that's a red flag and who knows
This woman might be divorced. She might have already had that. Or she could be a woman that's never really had a boyfriend. And she's just really bitter and angry about that. Who knows? But that's why I do these videos because I want to know what you guys think. So let me know what you think in the comments. Make sure to like this video. Um, subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you're on TikTok, make sure to show me some love and give me a follow over there. I really would appreciate it. I am over 3,000 uh, subscribers here on YouTube now, and I appreciate that. So let's get me to 5,000. <laughs> I'm just going to set a lofty goal, right? Why not? But anyway, thanks a lot for watching this video, guys, and uh, have a good day, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. May the force be with you.